hey guys, what's up? This is a portion of my house that you rarely see because it's not that aesthetically pleasing. <laughs> I know my makeup's really orange. I'm going through like this weird tan phase where I don't know if I'm tan or pale, but I look like a gang guru girl. And if anyone remembers pop star Trishy, <laughs> thumbs up this video. Um, so today I'm doing an unboxing. This is like not really that well thought out or anything like that. <laughs> not that any of my videos ever are. Um, <clears throat> But I spent a crazy amount of money one night, <laughs> drunk, on Dolls Kill. Dollskill.com is one of my favorite websites. Now, I wish, like, I have, hi, okay. I have contact, actually, with some people over at Dolls Kill. What up, Dolls Kill? Um, and uh, supposedly, or apparently, they're sending me, like, another box of goodies. So if you guys like this unboxing, I can unbox that one. This is stuff I picked out all myself and I paid for with all my own money. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> I wish they would, like, sponsor me or pay me to promote, but you know, they don't. <laughs> um, but that's okay, because I truly, truly love them. And um, honestly, like, Dolls Kill's everything. They're like, and Dolls Kill, the watching this video, like they are a little overpriced, but the stuff is cool and unique and different. And um, I think it's worth it. And I'm already hot and out of breath. So I'm gonna put my air on. Is that gonna be annoying? Oh my God, it is hot though in here. Please don't be um, So yeah, I was like, well, I spent $2,000 on this. Why not show it off? Also this shirt, is like my favorite shirt ever. We have these back on my shirt shop, which is trishshirts.com. This is like a double XL, and I love it because it's like my fat girl eating shirt because I've been feeling fat. I also have Hanes underwear on, but we don't need to show that. I also put a bra on for you guys, so that's how dedicated I am to this video. And I wonder if I should put this down a little more. Okay. Yeah, because this is a big a bill box, and... I kind of don't even remember everything I ordered. But I thought it'd be fun to take this out with you guys since obviously I have to unbox this. Anyways, why am I so hot? It's like sweating. It's only like 74 degrees in here, but I guess it's warm, huh? It's been so hot in LA. I gotta redo my outfit today. I was gonna wear these black pants, but it's not working out. So these, ooh! The first thing I see is like really bright and colorful. I'm like really stoked. Okay, all the paperwork. Returns and exchanges, all that stuff. Okay, this is so crazy. Woo -hoo -hoo! Are you guys seeing this huge box? This is so insane. So I got some hangers to hang some of this stuff so I can like, show you guys. And also I like to hang things right away. I like to just like fold it back up and put it in a pile and then I would never wear those clothes. Um, so this is crazy and I definitely Definitely don't remember ordering this, although I'm definitely, definitely not regretting ordering this. And it is this, I don't know what this is. It's like a zip down sweater. I'm like out of breath. Guys, I need to work out. This is crazy. <laughs> I have no idea in what world I thought this would be attractive on me, but I kind of look like Elton John. It's an XL, but Pretty snug. Then again, I've been gaining weight. Okay, Trish, we get it. You've been gaining weight. It's kind of cute. I have no idea what I'd wear this with, but you know, I can wear it with something, I'm sure. So there is the first item. Sorry if this is going to be so long. I feel like this is going to be so long. Okay. Moving on, we got a lot of clothes. Oh my gosh, you got me. I shaved my legs this morning. Thank God, because that's all you're seeing in this video. Okay, I got this shirt that said suck it. This was a last minute purchase. I do remember getting this because I put all the stuff in my cart and Dolls Kills is one of those sites where you can put all the stuff in the cart and I'll keep it the next day. You know, sometimes they like empty your cart for you when you come back or whatever because like you want to think on it. Trust me, I thought on this stuff. This is stuff I've been adding to the cart for like a month <laughs> and then I just like pulled the trigger. Oh, that's a bad term to use these days with all the gun violence, but I pulled the trigger so to speak and just bought everything because Coachella and stuff, right? Okay, these I really wanted, and I got something else that kind of goes with these. These are pants. Am I losing my voice too? This is crazy. That say, written and directed by Quentin Tarantino on the side, and it's kind of like Kill Bill-esque. And I love these. These are by a brand called Almighty, which is very small. <laughs> it says, disgusting girls are the best are the best, stay disgusting, okay. So these are large, 
Oh, hey, you absolute filth, but still cute. Um, these are large, but I know from experience, oh, they have like a little cuff at the bottom, that Doll's Kill is, um, I'm sorry, not Doll's Kill, Oh My Me, which is the brand. By the way, Doll's Kill carries a bunch of brands. They're not like a, they're not its own store. Um, but Oh Mighty is small. Like, even a large is going to be tight, and I could already tell in those pants. Like, I just really like them, so I got them, because I, I just know that brand is, like, really, really small. So here's some, like, festival. I'm sorry, I'm sorry you can't see my face. It's just probably more important to see the items. It's actually funner to do this on camera. I love shopping, but sometimes receiving the clothes. I mean, it's still fun to get a package, obviously, but this is cute. This is, like, a little, like, turtleneck tie-dye dress. I love these kind of dresses, like little maxi dress. Well, they're not little. They're big maxi dresses, but real cute. Has these little strings to hang them on so you don't stretch out the neck, which I've learned the hard way. Um, yeah, but then it doesn't get wrinkled. It's really, really, really cute. Oh my gosh, I'm just doing a hanger. I didn't have to find hangers. I take them because like, this is gonna require, I won't have hangers for all this. Um, Okay, this needs to be two parts. This is gonna be my longest video ever. <laughs> if you sit through this whole thing, let me know, or let me know how far you made it. Okay, this is cool. I will say, I saw this online and like loved it in person. Like the quality, like, and this is crazy because Dolls Quality is usually really great quality. Like I've been buying stuff from them forever, and I've like worn it in like music videos, like my Thick Girl video, and I wore shoes. Like I usually really love the quality, and it is like. Music video quality. I have no idea where my phone was. That's okay. Um, but this one is just a little disappointing. This is very like thin and like cheap material. I it looks like a heavy jacket. Um, it's fine. It's still cute. I mean, I don't. I don't really return things. Not because of anything other than being lazy. But I, if I did return things, I probably would return this just because it's the first thing that I'm like. I don't know. Maybe it's cuter on though. Sometimes you gotta give it a chance. Um. Okay, this is another, so Almighty has really cute stuff. Almighty, if you're listening, I wish you would just make the stuff a little bit thicker of a girl, but it's okay, it's all good. I'm gonna try and squeeze my little chubby body into this. This is a bodysuit, and it is the Scream Mask, which is kind of iconic, especially for people who are like my age, like 29, like our generation was like all about Scream, um, and so I got this. I just thought it was like really cool and like unique and different, and something I would wear. And I feel it is something where people would be like, oh, where did you get that? And that's like kind of what Dolls Kill is. They like they're like this buyer, like all these like really cool stuff that you can like, oh my god, where did you get that? Um, okay. Oh, here's something that's taking up a lot of room, but I thought was really, really cool actually. This is from a company brand called Jay Valentine. And I've loved Jay Valentine for so long. Like probably since I moved out to LA. I was always wanting their stuff, and their stuff's pretty expensive. Just like on their own. But I always want to start in my own like stripper clothing company so I can get this wholesale. But let me just show you guys this jacket. It's a light up jacket. Once I figure out how it lights up, I'll let you know. Let's see here. Okay. It's really cool. It's really, really pretty. I might actually just bring this for shits and giggles today. But it has like this like blue metallic right there. Um, so this lights up. It's heavy enough that it would be a light up jacket. I'm just trying to figure out how. Okay, there's like a zipper in here. You think it'd be easy to light a jacket up? Oh, okay, I'm feeling the battery pack. Okay, okay, okay. So the battery pack is on the top, actually. So it's a little heavy. Oh my god, there's like three battery packs. Oh, do you have to like turn it on? Woo! Did they have to turn them all on? Ho, ho, ho. Okay, I'm gonna turn this off for a little more, a little more ambiance. Oh my goodness, you guys. Oh my god, it's so weird actually, because like inside you can kind of feel all the wiring. So again, I guess this is just for like an aesthetic and not necessarily for comfort. Where is the sleeve? I hope this fits, because Jay Valentine is also known for being snug. Okay, let's, this one you have to come up to see me because I'm feeling like snuffle off like this. Okay. Like love the concept of this jacket. Love. Did I get makeup on my shirt? Oh well. <sighs> love the concept of this. It's it's hard to see too because it's like morning here. 
and it has a head. Like, it's cute. It's like small, but like I could zip it. Oh my God, this is like soups. Soups cute, actually. I'm like really feeling this. Oh my gosh, this is like, I mean, this is like iconic. Kind of, right? Like this is an iconic outfit. Like, tell me I'm lying. Oh, oh, I just started to do a thumbnail and everything almost collapsed. Okay. All right, guys, we are going to continue. We'll start with the stuff that fell out when I was trying to do another thumbnail because I love that jacket so much and I would like, I would click to see where someone got that jacket. <laughs> um, okay. Got these shades because they remind me of aliens and like aliens is like a thing now. Let's try these on. Oh my god, with my like light jacket tonight, I'm gonna be so cool. I don't even know what I'm doing tonight, but I'm gonna wear that outfit out. <laughs> I love these. They're really cheap. My glasses on on there are cheap. Cheap AF. Um I'm like sweating. I like need a break. <laughs> um, okay. This is another thing that fell out. These are bottoms. And the bottoms don't fit too bad actually on Doll's Kill. They're kind of like these like bell bottom. Bottoms, got the XL. These look like they may be a little snug, but you know, gold pants. They're just cute, they just have like aliens and like skulls. I just kind of like the overall like graffiti theme of it. Um, love those. They just have like really bright fun stuff, especially around this time of year. I feel like they really... Okay, this shirt was in my cart for a while because it says spring break forever, and obviously spring break is Everyone's pretty much off their spring break. But it's pretty cute. I don't know, it's just like a mesh shirt. It's pretty see-through. Um, this could be an option to wear today. I love like hauling and unboxing stuff because I can't ever find my clothes anywhere. So when I get new stuff, I'm like, I'll just wear this thing. Okay, there's like a bunch of little accessories. This one says Trixie Star. These are all surprises to me too. So I mean, I, I actually put these out, but I just don't remember anything that I got. Okay, this is like a little like crazy weird necklace. And it says, this is like seriously still a surprise to me. Oh, it says daydream. That's cute. And like little kid letters. It's kind of a cool little. Yeah, it's kind of cute. I have no long I've been how long I've been unboxing for. I found my phone. And I have to like go after this. So I have to do a speed wash on my washing machine. So that's what you're, that's what you're hearing. And I'm sorry that bothers people. Sometimes it really bothers people. It doesn't actually bother me when I hear people doing laundry in the background. Um, so here are some chokers. <laughs> this is my life, you guys. I don't do laundry for like a month and then like right when I'm about to film a video. But this is taking me some time. This may be my longest video in history. Oh! <laughs> Here's a little choker. I'm getting a lot of stuff for my money for $2,000. A little over two thousand dollars, maybe three thousand dollars. <laughs> I'm getting a lot of stuff for my money. Little chokers, like a best friend's choker, except it has a profanity in the middle, but you can give it to three. Like if you have three best friend groups, you can give it to them. I only have one best friend, and that's my boyfriend, <laughs> and he definitely won't wear that. But they're cute, anyways. This is candy squirrel. Of glasses. Alright. They're pretty heavy. It's weird that you can't see. Okay, well, this is something I didn't know I needed and still not sure I needed. But, you know, okay. Coachella, Burning Man, I don't really know what these are for, but we'll put them in the accessory pile over here. I'm trying to organize this as I go along because I just have so many. Okay, here's more. Here's some purpley sunglasses, which actually look really, really cute. I love big oversized glasses. I actually just bought some like this the other day. Totally forgot I got them. Oh my god, these are actually really, really cute. I love like the detailing of them. Yeah, those are these are adorable. I'm really happy I got these. These are very Coachella E. Coachella esque. Just come with like a little like case for them, which is cute. And then 
have these little ears, which I think is super cute. I love little like headband accessories. Kind of like ASMR a little bit. Okay, they're cute. They're not like super cheap. They're cute. Oh my god, I might wear these today. These are the I might wear these today pile over here. Ugh. I got a little hair stuck in my mouth. Okay, okay, okay. She was like the moon. A part of her was always hidden away. This was really cool. Um, it's been pretty kill star, which someone once told me was satanic. I don't know if that's true, but um, I really liked the uh, like astro astrological aspect of this notebook, and I love little notebooks. Um, so it's just like a blank journal. But again, I just kind of like the saying. Part of her was always hidden. True. Facts. Nothing but facts today. Um, oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, a lot of this is shoes, so this is a good sign because I was like, this is like never gonna end. These are little eco nesting boxes, little like storage boxes, which I am. I know I always say this. I'm always trying to diet, but I am trying to diet, so I do like to pack. This is like so bad for your nails. Don't I have scissors somewhere? I swear I am boxes. I'm sorry if you're just seeing like a big Hanes panty line. Yeah, here they are. Okay. These are really heavy. People always ask me when they come over. I mean, I don't really show my videos, so no one really videos really ask me, but every time people come over, oh my god, your scissors. And one person guessed exactly where they were from. They're from Target, and I guess they're part of the Nate Burkus collection. And I didn't know that they were like bougie, but they are like $30. I don't consider them bougie. I mean, they're just scissors. I just liked them, and they were heavy. Just FYI. Okay, nesting boxes. I get it. They all fit inside each other, kind of like those like little dolls. So they just like all, these are cute. There's like another one in there, but you get the gist. Huh, ah, cute. I thought they were fun for summer, like little snacks of like Cheez-Its or Goldfishes or whatever the case is. Um, I really wish I would have dropped this morning before my shower, but I shoulda, woulda, coulda. All right, moving on. A little pink furry something or another. What is this? This is like sexy. It's a two-piecer. Oh yeah, I remember this. This was cute. I don't know if this is gonna fit either because it's hit or miss, but that's really cute. It's like a skirt. And then this sort of like top, like a halter top. Cute. I've had a lot of back fat. I looked at myself in the Actors Hollywood interview and I was like, ugh. So much back fat in it. I need to, I need to get on the treadmill. I haven't worked out you guys in like a month or two months. It's bad, it's like a thing. Um, and I've just been enjoying myself, just eating through life, eating through life, skimming the surface. What is this? This is something that looks really complicated. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's one of those like little crop titties, but it has like a little chain, which is kind of cute. You have to wear like a tank top underneath. That's actually super cute. I might wear that today. It's getting really warm here now, though, so I don't know. Actually, I can't wear that today. I'm going to wear a pink hoodie later. My little light up fur jacket. Check me out on Instagram. I'm just waiting to see if I end up wearing it. They also have Wild Fox on a Dolls Kill, which is super cute and so up my alley. This has been in my cart forever, so I was surprised I still had it. This is like a little unicorn magic sweater. Wild Fox like sweatsuits are like my absolute all time favorite things to wear. They're so comfy, they're supposed to be oversized. And then I got the matching pants, and I see them right here. You guys, there's so much trash everywhere on my floor. It's actually a little out of control. Those are the pants. So they have like little unicorn matching pants, and the Wild Hawks pants are actually the best. I have these in gray, black, navy blue. They're actually so comfortable. Like I can never get rid of my Wild Hawks pants. They're like all my faves. Oh my God, I'm getting hungry. <laughs> I have to be on a diet. Another little alien merch. Should I take a little break? No, it's too more out of breath to eat. <laughs> mm, guys, this is like. Maybe I should sit for some of this. It's a little too cute for this world. Later losers. It's just like a cute little bag, I thought. I don't really know. I think they might have called this a makeup bag, which could be. I have an alien makeup bag that I take on all my travels with me from Dolls Kill, and I'm like obsessed. Oh yeah, this is like a little, it's super cute. 
Just like a little makeup bag, or you could use it as like a lunch bag or something. Real, real cute. Love of this. I just have literal like just junk everywhere. <laughs> it happens, yo. It happens. Okay, let's get rid of some of these shoe boxes. Oh, this is a teapot set. This is like a narwhal set. It doesn't say narwhal, but I think it is. Or maybe it's just a unicorn. A narwhal is like a unicorn whale, but I think these might just be unicorns. Okay. We might need to pop a squat. Oh my gosh, why are we feeling sick today? Oh, you guys can't see anything if we pop a squat too much. Let's angle you guys down a little more. Or not. Narwhal eating a bagel. Okay, there. Now you're seeing more. Whew! Unboxing stuff you bought online is a workout. I'm gonna sneeze. I'm gonna sneeze. Am I gonna sneeze? <sighs> We're good, everybody. We are golden, actually. Okay. See if this came on one piece. Teapots are a tricky thing to buy online. It's broken. <laughs> Shoot, I knew it would be. Well, this is still intact. Oh, the plate broke. The cup is still intact. The little saucer plate broke, which I think is one of the cutest parts of like a tea set that sucks. Lid looks like it's still intact though, so. So people don't step on broken glass. No. Well, that's cute though. I think maybe because they put so much into the box, like it was just one big box that came. It's a bummer. It's okay. I'll live. Yeah. I did go a little crazy with shoes because they have like a the cutest shoes. Like I was like buying so many last year and I was like, I need to stop buying shoes. But I just couldn't help myself. I'm on a Dolls Kill Spree. I just went a little nuts, a little crazy. Oh, this I thought were super cute. I could have passed these up. These were like pink patent leather like heels. And they're like chunky and kind of 90s, but like easy to walk into. So like, I mean, obviously I could have passed those up. These are so cute. Yeah, but literally the cute shoes. And their shoes aren't like that expensive online. Like I would say they're from like 60 to like maybe like a couple hundred bucks for like boots and stuff. But um, they're not like high design or prices or anything. These are another pair of shoes I got. Ooh, yes. These are creeper shoes, which I don't know if they do me justice, but these are really cute. They're pink leopard and like high, my aesthetic with rainbow laces. Like, I mean, could have passed these up. I just cannot. All right, there's a couple outfits on top of a couple more shoe boxes. Okay, this says current mood. And this says face tuned. Okay, I can get into that. I don't know why I bought that, but you know, I bought it, so I'm committing to it. I feel like when you get to the end of your box, it's like, why did I buy all this crap? I don't know, because it was really fun to look at online. I mean, people that are in the fashion business do a really good job of marketing. This is a little leopard crop jacket, which actually has a matching skirt. I do remember buying this, and it reminded me of Nomi Malone from Showgirls, which is why I got this set. And the skirt, I will show it to you. Oh, and then I got a bunch of skirts like this. I think I got like three skirts in this exact same style. Again, this is an Almighty brand, so it's gonna be my weight loss inspiration, I have a feeling, because this brand is just tends to run a little small. Um, but how cute is that with like the chain? And like this is so 90s, like with the pink shoes. Oh my god, like I just I couldn't like little crop tops with it. Okay. This little number. Oh, this is cute. I remember getting this. This is super cute. This is just like a little like angelic dress. This looks a little small, but it does have some decent stretch in there. So this will be a hang up one. This is just reminding me of like a little princess dress. This will be something I have to hang up. Um, I got a couple of these pens. They're like little fuzzy pens, which remind me of Clueless, kind of 90s. Like dolls feel very 90s, reminiscent, like nostalgia, vintage. Oh yeah, this actually flopped out really nice. This is so cute. I got two of them because like I used to be obsessed with these pens and they're so hard to find. They used to 
back in my day when i was a little kid you would you would find these literally everywhere like claire's the icing gas stations like these were such a thing so um love that i just think it's super cute like if you're just like out and about and you like signing with that like too adorable okay here's some more of mighty things like i'm telling you oh mighty has the cutest like ish like really really cute like honestly oh mighty i'm thinking of meeting with you please make up to like 3x because honestly they're small like you said i can wear a large like from 21 fashion nova but Oh mighty, I mean, I'd probably be a 2X, because even an XL, but that's super cute. <laughs> it's like a Bratz logo, but it says cons and sequins. Okay. Yeah, it's a little foul mouth, but, you know, oh mighty. Oh mighty, don't give no Fs. I'm, like, trying not to wear it. I just, like, cons. Um, this is another one. This is a Quentin Tarantino-inspired bodysuit. It says, be cool, honey bunny, um, which is so cute, actually. Oh, my gosh. I need to work out so I can wear these, like, cute tight pants. I love tight pants clothes. All right, there's a couple more clothing items. Oh, now there's a lot more clothing items. I'm going to try and show all these. <clears throat> and there's two shoe boxes. Okay. So this is another festival inspired. Just because I don't know what to wear, and I feel like when the time comes, I'm going to feel overwhelmed and flustered to find anything, or I'll just feel like pressure to get something. And so I saw this stuff and I thought it was cute just as is, and the stuff I would wear just as is. So I got it just for options. Um, but like I said, I would wear this. How is this go? This is like, oh, this is like a little, it's a little bralette thing too that you could wear or something. It's crochet, it's really nice, bright neon colors, which I love. Then we have, oh yeah, this dress was really cute. This reminded me, I'm going to put this pile on the couch and I'll show you it up close with this dress because it was really, really cute. So you can see up close, it's kind of like that pretty woman style dress and just have a bunch of like tabloids on it. Oh, that's the real ones. It's like Lindsay Lohan tabloids and like JWoww. I thought it was like really cute and really like 2000-ish. My house, if you guys saw my house right now, you would be like, how? Do you live? It's like basically like I live in a storage unit, <laughs> which I don't like living that way. That's why I sell stuff online. Um, okay. I just love a new clothes. Literally like my splurge. Um, oh, this was really cute. Yeah, I remember reading this. This is like a little like 90s sort of. This would actually be really cute today, maybe with my pink hoodie. The cups are very small though. I just noticed it's like I'm XL and the cups, there's like little cups in there. Just makes me a little nervous. Ooh, I'm so excited about this. This is so nostalgia. Like, this is something you could find on eBay probably for five dollars. But because it was like in a cute little crop hoodie, I, and it was brand new, I was just like, okay, I need this. This is like a little cute in sync hoodie, and I got mine in like a two XL or something because I do love these. Like, how cute is that though? Like, throwback, throwback Thursday. I don't know when you're seeing this, but we'll just pretend it's throwback Thursday. And if you're actually watching it on Thursday, let me know. Um, this is just like a flower headband, like a little light up one because I love light up things. And you know, Coachella, how many times? Take a shot every time I say Coachella, just kidding. Unless you're of age, then do it, that'd be funny. But also then you'd get drunk. And this is a light up one and it just lights up. I'm like, wow, ah, all pretty. Yeah, this is, that's sick. J Valentine is that like very like raver, like raver brand. And then these are more of those like skirts. I got a leopard one. I just have like a red leopard one. So that's the one that goes with that little top that I was telling you about that's very numb and long with some black thigh highs. You'd be killing it. We're almost in the end, y'all. We're almost getting there. It's been a journey. And this is the same. The chain that I will say in person is like not as heavy as it looks, which I guess is good. It's more for comfort, but or it's better for comfort. Okay, two last clothing items. I got two shoe boxes and a random box in there. Another Almighty. This is a Stanley Kubrick one, which I think is cool. I love that they're doing like film geek sort of stuff. Um, this says a Stanley Kubrick production. Um, I love Stanley Kubrick. He's amazing. You haven't seen his movies. Like, he was a director that did a lot of movies in the 70s, a lot of iconic movies in the 70s. And then this, oh, this is just like a cute little sweetheart top. The smock top, so that was white, white. I'm gonna show my stomach this summer. That's my goal. All right, so that's it for the clothes. I'm gonna put them over here for now so I can finish off the rest of this box. I wear. Oh, these reminded me, these were like little tiny Britney Spears sunglasses. I don't know if you guys can see. I don't know if these are gonna look good on my face because I have such a large face, like a wide face always. 
But, you know, people wear them like this. It's actually kind of cute. I actually don't hate. I've seen a lot of people wear these, like bring them back in a tan and wear some baby glasses. Um, and they're cute. They remind me of Reese because she used to wear them all the time. All right, we got two shoe boxes in here, and they're both by Current Mood. Don't follow Dolls Co. on Instagram because I'm telling you they promote this stuff and you just want to click it. As soon as you see it, you're just like, I'm buying it. I want it. They just, as I said, they make them very appealing, which is marketing 101, make something appealing. These are too sick. I mean, hi, grassroots, come on. That's, that's too much. These are so freaking cute. They're so springy. I just think these are so extra and like I just needed because what? Do you imagine walking around with just turf? They're just so kind of hideous, but they just work. And um, I was gonna say like myself, I'm trying to not be so self-deprecating. I just like knocked over half those lights. Okay. And then the final shoes from Kurt Oh, they're green as well. I'm just gonna green. Okay, these I love. I have no idea where I'm wearing these, but I just thought these were so pretty. I like couldn't pass them up. They're just like green leopard booties, which is so random and a weird way to end this video. But I hope you guys did enjoy this unboxing video. Thanks for actually being here with me and sitting through this with me because I just feel like I love shopping online and I love wearing the clothes, but like unboxing, like I used to work in a receiving part of a warehouse and hated it because this is all you did. That is so scary. It just went out of focus. And someone told me when it goes out of focus, there's a ghost to run. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up. I just invited all this alien stuff into my house. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thumbs up if you want to see the next package that Dolls Kill sends me. They just, I guess they sent me a package randomly. They're very cool, you guys, in all sincerity. They're really, really cool. They don't need to pay people to promote their ish because it's, it's cool. You know, they're just cool. They're awesome. They're cool peeps. Um, and I'm going to go. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. You can get my merch at trishirts.com. <laughs> Cheaper. And I love you guys. Until next time, you're going to see some all the way Bye, guys.